Once upon a time, in the age of the Eternal Cylinder, there lived a family of little creatures called the Trebum. Trebum are not the strongest, nor the fastest, and they do not have sharp teeth. They would make easy prey for the terrible force that came to their planet. But Trebum are loyal and resourceful and very, very stubborn. It is with such a Trebum that our story begins. One clever little creature born into a cruel world who would be instrumental in bringing prosperity to its kind. Run, something inside him said. Run! Oh, yeah, I <laughs> should run. Okay, alright. How big is this? Oh, that is quite significantly huge. Oh, right, I am running. I am running. I am trying to run with my little legs. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Well, welcome everyone to the Eternal Cylinder. <laughs> oh, wait. Ah. Uh, um, how am I gonna get out? Can I get out over here? Can I? Come on. Oh, no. I don't think so. I can. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! The great crushing thing, the great cylinder, had stopped. Perhaps it was safe here for a little while. How quickly it learned to use its legs and its trunk. But these things were not so much learned as they were remembered. Perhaps, the little Trebum thought, they were a gift from the strange voice it heard in its mind. I that spit at you. was a kind of memory. Hey, this guy just pooped out something. Pink. <laughs> just when it was starting to get used to its legs, the food from the jumping creature gave it new ones. But the right substance is a catalyst. A trebum right. can transform and yeah. adapt to many challenges. Let's uh, not kid ourselves. Um, the food or the stuff that we just ate was poop. It was poop. So, yeah. Anyway, uh, hello everyone. Welcome back to Command Wolf Gaming. I'm CWG, and welcome to um, the Eternal Cylinder. God dang it. Um, uh, yes, we're doing this today. Now I. I'm assuming that all, a bunch of you guys already know how this game works. We consume stuff and then we evolve. Like so. Now I'm a Julie. I look so ugly. Can I? Okay. This guy gives me food, apparently. Yeah, that's food. All right. So, yeah, th that's that's the basic of this game. There, there isn't much more to it. <laughs> um. Uh, basically, this is kind of like my playthrough of the game. And I, I know that uh, plenty of playthroughs have already been gone and still been uh, being gone through. But, uh, you know, it's not too bad an idea to try. Especially if this might turn into a very good game in the end uh, for us to continue playing. So, uh, let's The Trebum see was drawn got. to a bright light. Or perhaps to the creature next to it. I'm not, see, I'm not drawn over there. You, you, you're, you're driving me over there. I'm going this way. I'm seeing what's over here. Which is just water. Interesting. Okay, can I go? I'm sure if I go in the opposite direction. Ooh, there's some roly-poly things and glittering doodads over here. Like, look at this 
glittery guy. Hi. Okay, never mind. He doesn't like me. Um. Oh, hello. Yes, this gives me an ability. If we can hit the right dang key on the keyboard. There we go. Ooh. Do you make your trunks? Let the uh, make a sound that can start off rain predators. <laughs> run, little things, run! Yikes. Okay, I I'm assuming I have to go back over here. So. I got these things over here, too. And they're so ugly. Except Look for the that. grass growing on the old one's head. Oh, this guy's stuck. They were very much alike. <laughs> oh, it's a trebon. A very old. And Surrounded by this light, the trebum knew things it had not known before. It knew the older trebum had carried this light for a long, long time. And it knew that now that responsibility had passed to the next generation. Yes. This young Trebum had to carry the light to those great towers in the distance. It could have stayed here to learn many old things, but the cylinder would not allow it. No, you will die. We will rule. Run, the inner voice said, run. The towers would not stop the cylinder unless they were activated. Okay, so here's here's a dumb question. I, I've I've already I'm gonna start poking holes in this uh, game's story and background, right? So if the towers are the only thing that stops, um, you know, this eternal cylinder, why did that eternal Quickly. cylinder the stop at step on the location the symbol, where it the stopped would not at? Especially, stopped. Okay, th thank you. I get that. Um, like because like if that older Trebon uh, right if he um, was supposed to be going around and like doing all this and but he's been laying there for a while that is absolutely terrifying honestly and he's been sitting there for a while long enough for like grass and stuff to start growing on him does that mean that he already act uh, activated like a whole bunch of these The voice inside the Trebum's memories assured it that while the tower stood, the Trebum would be safe. The power of the eternal cylinder was contained for now. Okay, so as I was saying, does it mean that he activated it and he this just because of whatever... relative tranquility gave the Trebum a chance to think about its family? Trebum are not meant to live alone, so where were the others? As I was saying, um, does that mean that like it activated a whole bunch of uh, them? And also, where is my um, parents? Because I was just left alone in the the nest, you know. Uh, you know what I mean? So like, where could of my parents went to? Is he my parent? And he just happened to pass away. He or she? Um, Finding another Trebum was a cause for joy, but this new friend was not well. Deep inside the memories it had inherited, the Trebum found the answer. To recover, Please its friend this. needed a very specific substance, which appeared crystal as glittering dust. clusters of crystal dust. Give me all of this. This dust was not natural. Only a great Trebum could create it. And so it was on the achievements of previous generations that the newborn Trebum would have to rely. Okay. Luckily, it seemed a wise and powerful Trebum had passed through here some time ago. Nice. All right. So I think there's an inventory system here. Let's see. I, yes. Okay. So we can separate this and give that guy some bouncy legs as well. Um, okay, so yeah, I, I, I'm just kind of poking, you know, um, holes in the whole story now. So, but uh, yeah, anyhow, uh, 
I'm gonna explore around real quick. Alright, so it looks like we have an egg over here that we have to get. Um, unfortunately, uh, well, let me put some food in my mouth. Uh, I think we're gonna have a bit of a hard time. Let me see if I can do this. Uh, roll, jump, and... Uh, Our young friend ah! had found an egg. A Trebum egg with one of his siblings inside. Yes. The egg had been abandoned, but it could still be made to hatch. All that was needed was a source of heat. Go away! A new family member. Come this way, guys. We gotta gather some stuff. Um, okay, let's see. Ooh, fish. We got a fish. Can I get multiple fish? I can. That guy doesn't like us. Go away. Oh, ow! What the heck? All right, fine. I'll go this way. Jerk. Ooh. We got a frozen zone. Can I be in here? Is this going to cause me problems? I don't know. Looks like it will. Ooh, smoke. Smoke, 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 smoke. Is there anybody down here? There's something else over there, too. Hey, we got another treble. Sweet. That's a fuzzy thing over there. I don't know what that is. It's dangerous. I'm running away. Whoa, look at this massive thing here. It's, it's still alive. There's a crystal thing here. Hey, big guy. What's going on? Hey, hey, can you see me? Are you friendly? Or you sound like you, you're not doing good, too good, bud. Uh, want some water? You seem to be partially in water. Seem like a water-based creature. Uh... I guess not. All right. Boop. This All right, come on, my family. Had been built for Trebum. Yes, it, it has been built for us. That in this large and dangerous world, some places had been made for them. My children, my family, we have made it to a sanctuary. <laughs> All right, let's go in. Ooh, Herler. I can swatch treble. I guess I'm gonna play as you now. Oh, you don't have the jumpy legs. Look at that! I got some crystals! Give me all that. Give me everything! And more crystal. Ooh. That's a uh, square me. Uh, let's take a look. Something is glowing on my head. Somehow this ancient statue transferred knowledge to the Trevor. Ooh! So this tells me of all the things that actually provide me with stuff. Probably food or special abilities like the Leap Tail. But this organic <coughs> cube of rare organic growth found near certain ancient trap home structures most likely artificial in origin hmm. it yes. was as if a memory had been stored inside it waiting for someone to absorb it and as soon as this knowledge had entered their minds the trebum realized that there was a great library <laughs> of information hidden away in the web of their memories but why was the knowledge of a specific ingredient placed here in this trebum made of stone? Hey, I'm square now. 
<laughs> I'm gonna have all these uh, crystals here. Thank you. Can I roll? I can still roll! Now here's the question. Is it worth me having a multiple square treble or not? Looks like there's another passage over here. Hmm. Ew! Wait, what? Ew, look how fleshy that is! Oh, my dear lord, I did not want to see this. And we do have a square hole over here. Sweet. I, I want to know why I couldn't put a circle in there and just have it do the same thing, right? Unless it really acknowledges the, uh, the square. Give me all the crystals. Give me a bunch of crystals. That's right. Nothing but crystals. What do we have in here? Can I switch? What do you have? Okay. That's food. Was there something else? I thought there was something else in here. Looked kind of weird. I already have jumpy legs, so let me just eat this. Then, aha! There was something else. So let's go back to this guy right here. In fact, let's just kind of sort this out real quick because I do have a lot of uh, stuff here. Bring that there. Let's see what this uh, does. Causes treble and skin to grow a patch of grass like hair which attracts sack flies. Wonderful. It's very attracting. Okay, so I'm assuming we're supposed to go here, square peg, square hole, right, 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 Garumo the Elder. Hello, Garumo. I'm here to talk to you. I'm just going to stand here in a puddle and talk to you. Inside the cave, the Trebum found a living elder. It had been waiting in this chamber for a long, long time. The elder told them it was happy to see some friends before the cylinder came. It said, You are young. So you never knew the time when our people could shapeshift at will. We, Trebam, are inheritors of a vast tree of abilities. Abilities passed on to all future Trebam. But this power is being taken away. Beware the servants of the Cylinder. They will seek to hurt you at every opportunity. And they have the power to rob you of your abilities. But if you persevere, one day, you will find a way to protect yourselves from their evil light. Farewell, my brave friends. I fear I am too old and tired to join you. May you find a way to prosper in this time of struggles. So, am I going to grow as big and tall as him? And did I get the uh, way to understand the language? from the dead um, elder that was outside uh, who gave me this ability to stop the, to stop the cylinder. I, I have so many questions, but I don't think you're really giving me an answer here, elder. But I, I guess that, uh, th thank you anyway. Um, with that <laughs> being said, I'm going to wrap it up today, guys. I want to thank everyone for tuning in today here on Command Wolf Gaming. Hope you enjoyed the footage. If you have any comments or suggestions, make sure to leave it down below in the comment section. I want to hear from you guys. Uh, did you guys know about 95% of you guys are not subscribed to the channel yet? That's right. 95% of you guys are not subscribed to the channel yet. Whoa. I already punted that guy across the uh, room. Uh, so make sure to hit that big red subscribe button down below. And uh, like I always say, folks... Uh, well, not, yeah, like I always say, um, 
all the subscriptions help out the channel and also hit that bell notification button because all the uh, you guys will be notified on when I'm updating the channel. So I want to thank everyone for tuning in and as always like, subscribe, and share. Spread the love and I hope to see you next time here on Command Wolf Gaming. Bye bye now!